Hello students. Welcome to Teach You Smart. Let's continue our journey through rational numbers. In the previous session, we have seen that there are countless rational numbers between any two given rational numbers. Clearly, we can say that the midpoint or mean of any two rational numbers will also be a rational number. For example, between 0 and 1, there is a rational number 1 by 2, which is the midpoint of both 0 and 1. Between 0 and 1 by 2, the midpoint is 1 by 4. Then, what about the midpoint of 1 by 2 and 1? How can we find it? Yes, here we recall the concept of mean. What is mean? We have already learnt mean in our previous grades. We can say that the mean is the average found by adding all observations together and then dividing it by the number of observations. That is, mean equals the sum of all observations divided by the number of observations. When we take the mean, we get the exact mid value or the midpoint of the given observations. Here, we have to find the midpoint of two numbers. By taking the mean of these two numbers, we get its midpoint. That is, mean equals sum of two numbers, divided by two. Therefore, the midpoint of one by two and one is one by two plus one. The whole divided by two equals 3 by 2 divided by 2 equals 3 by 4 which is the rational number between 1 by 2 and 1. By observing this number line, we can say that 0 less than 1 by 4 less than 1 by 2 less than 3 by 4 less than 1. Now we can see 1 by 2 lies between 1 by 4 and 3 by 4. Is 1 by 2 the midpoint of both 1 by 4 and 3 by 4? Let's check. Taking the mean of 1 by 4 and 3 by 4, we get 1 by 4 plus 3 by 4 whole divided by 2 equals 4 by 4 divided by 2 equals 1 by 2. Therefore, 1 by 2 is the midpoint of 1 by 4 and 3 by 4. Now we have 0 less than 1 by 2, less than 1. 0 less than 1 by 4, less than 1 by 2, and 1 by 2, less than 3 by 4, less than 1. Here, we can write the midterm as the mean of the other two numbers. That is, instead of 1 by 2, we can write 1 by 2 is equal to 0 plus 1 divided by 2. Similarly, 1 by 4 is equal to 0 plus 1 by 2 divided by 2. And 3 by 4 is equal to 1 by 2 plus 1 divided by 2. So in general, for any two rational numbers, a and b, a plus b, divided by 2, is a rational number between a and b, such that a less than a plus b divided by 2 less than b. Let's see another example. Find three rational numbers between 1 by 3 and 1 by 2 by mean method. For that, take the mean of 1 by 3 and 1 by 2. That is, 1 by 3 plus 1 by 2 divided by 2 equals 5 by 6 divided by 2 equals 5 by 12. Now, we can take the mean of 1 by 3 and 5 by 12. That is, 
1 by 3 plus 5 by 12 whole divided by 2 equals 4 plus 5 by 12 whole divided by 2 equals 9 by 12 whole divided by 2 equals 3 by 8 also take the mean of 5 by 12 and 1 by 2 5 by 12 plus 1 by 2 whole divided by 2 equals 5 plus 6 by 12 whole divided by 2 equals 11 by 12 whole divided by 2 equals 11 by 24. Similarly, we can find more rational numbers between any two given rational numbers by the mean method. Let's recall what we discussed today. Finding rational numbers between any two given rational numbers by mean method. Before winding up let's check how much you understood by doing an activity. 1. Find four rational numbers between 2 by 3 and 5 by 7 by mean method. 2. Find three rational numbers between 1 by 5 and 1 by 8. That's all for now. See you all in the next class with another interesting chapter.